This video shows the multifunctional aviation client application built by Luciad. The application builds on experiences from OWS6, OWS7, and the SAA pilot, and uses a number of OGC standards-based components available in the Luciad Map software suite. The application incorporates both dispatch and flight planning capabilities. An important task to achieve this was the ability to connect with all available web services in OWS-8 aviation. This also ensured proper interoperability and helped to identify improvements to the standards where needed. During the flight planning phase, the pilot may be interested in checking out the various facilities and their current status at one of the destination airports. He can zoom in on the airport and load the features of interest on the map. Where possible, the client uses symbology and coding styles to visualize the current state according to IKO guidelines. Because the IKO guidelines do not define styling for the entire airport layout, we defined a few custom styles. For instance, a red hatching pattern is used to indicate that a given runway is closed. A second example is the styling of a contaminated apron. Information on the type of contaminant and its extent are retrieved from the AIXM5 data and used to render the apron with an appropriate color. For instance, the green color indicates that the apron is covered with grass, which is also shown in the data browser. The light blue color indicates that the apron is contaminated with ice. Finally, we created a style for point lights based on the IKO guidelines and the color information stored in the AIXM5 data. These colored points represented the biggest challenge for the use of symbology encoding. Because the point lights are modeled in AIXM as a set of nested elements inside an enclosing light system, a new composite rule type had to be defined to support this styling. During the descent and approach phase of the flight, the dispatcher has to avoid any active special activity airspaces. He can load the airspaces close to his flight path to see whether they might affect his flight. An appropriate style is chosen to indicate airspaces that are going to be activated. The results of the OGC SAA pilot project give a more in-depth look at this capability. A flight dispatcher might be interested in detailed weather information at the destination airport. To this end, the National Weather Service has developed guidance TAFs and made them available through a web feature server in the WXXM format. Our client can load these guidance TAFs and expose every detail of them through its data browser. While preparing the flight, the dispatcher can inspect the nav aids that are suitable for his flight. He also subscribes to an event service to ensure that he receives all digital NOTAMs that may affect the nav aids. When such a NOTAM is received, he can zoom in on the relevant nav aid and evaluate whether an alternate nav aid needs to be chosen. In this video, we showed how a flight dispatcher or pilot can use our client application to seamlessly interact with various web services and select exactly the data that is of importance to him. Combining all of this data into one common operational picture increases situational awareness and supports decision-making.